what's up guys we uh we're gonna play some uh tom clancy's rainbow six siege today i thought about doing a live stream and i thought no i'll just go ahead and do an actual video so um yeah i haven't put a lot of time into this game um i'm just kind of i've just been kind of casually playing it i have a lot of games going right now uh but i enjoyed it, it it's a really good game when I first got it, I, I played it quite a bit, but I haven't played it for a while, so I'm a little rusty. Actually, wait, what am I doing here? I'm sorry, guys. Um, I like to do bots with, uh, like, uh, I like to do multiplayer, but I like the enemy team to be bots. So, Terror's Taunt. Let's see, 47 seconds, huh? Yeah, I'm not sure if they fixed their matchmaking system. I know they did. They did patch it while I was working on this game, or I mean playing this game, uh, when it first came out. After about a week, they did semi-fix it. I don't know if it, it doesn't seem to be either that or just no one's playing. Um, which could be the case, I imagine, but... Okay, let me, uh, let's try this again. Yeah, it doesn't seem, I don't know what to tell you guys. <laughs> I can't control that part of it. I want to start playing too. This is annoying. Well, all right. I guess I'll play multiplayer then. I guess no one's playing that mode. But yeah, I don't know if they fixed the uh, the multiplayer uh, issues completely yet, uh, yet or not. And let me know if you guys like this, attempting to uh, your bombs. me using like animals and, and weird uh, 3D stuff uh, on cam instead of me. I think it's Headshot. The fuck? Did you guys just see that over on the left side? What the fuck was that? <laughs> yeah, I guess we joined the game already in progress. Uh, someone probably died or got team killed or something, and I'm just waiting for the round to end so that I can join in. Oh, dude got fucking wrecked. Located a bomb. You know what to do. A bomb has been located by Op 4. Mission failed. 
All friendlies have been neutralized. I knew he was gonna get fucking red. I'll probably get red too because I'm rusty and I'm not very good at this game, I'll be honest. I mean, sometimes with with me and and uh, shooter. Well, actually, no, I can't, I take that back. All games. Um, I'm kind of sporadic. Like a one one match, I can be really really good, do really good, and then like the next three matches, I I I do like you know I suck ass. So. Everything seems to be running good. Just start to to locate the bomb. All this crap running. Dude, all this shit. CPU gets a lot higher than it usually does in this game. With this game, my CPU usually sits around 30 to 40 uh, percent usage. Uh, right now, I'm getting about 70 to 75. Because I got. Fucking OBS running, I've got face rig running, and, uh, yeah, so, face rig taking up about, mm, Five seconds 40 to go. percent, Be advised your I drone think. has located a bomb. The diffuser has been recovered. Proceed to bomb's location and defuse it. That's okay, I got plenty of CPU to go around. Uh, I-7, 59, 30k, 6 so I'm not too worried about it. Enemy located. <laughs> Must recover the diffuser. <laughs> oh, man. I knew someone was going to come down the stairs. Guys, that's cool. Friendly, last operator standing. Yeah, so if uh, anybody who's still watching uh, this far into this video, which I, I, some of you hopefully still are, <laughs> uh, oh damn, Op four eliminated uh, go ahead all and subscribe, friendly. that it really means a lot to me, it really helps me out, uh, really makes a difference, yeah, especially me, you know, I've got 8 subscribers, I just started, I, I, like I said, I've had a YouTube account for a long time now, I never really took it seriously. Um, until recently and I just I got I uploaded a video and I thought you know I had a lot of fun doing that and I have a computer that I can do all this stuff with and not have uh, uh, any performance issues now as well so um, yeah I'm enjoying it so I hope you guys subscribe it, I mean it really helps me out it really makes a big difference
I'm really disappointed with the name that I see in multiplayer games these days. Most of them are so uncreative. And, and I'm not, you know, like saying that mine is amazing or anything, but I just, I don't know. I remember playing multiplayer games back in the day. The names were just, people tried to be more creative. They were like, they would make you laugh, you know, or chuckle when you see it. I don't have a lot of uh, characters unlocked because I don't really get it. Like I said, I don't really get into this game. I like it, Protect but I don't like all the microtransaction stuff in it, and that really fucking bothers me, especially in a game like this. So. It just, that just steers me away from wanting to really do anything. Reinforcement you know, in place! Just play the game that you buy a bomb location. Uh, I don't really get into the touch mission area. too much of the game. Be advised, Op 4 has found I mean, I a do bomb. I do and I don't. Yeah, I do with my weapon loadouts and stuff, but... 10 seconds remaining. 5 seconds to insertion. Bomb. Get ready to engage. Okay. You can stop worrying about grenades now. You better rebuild that, dude. I usually kill people for protect. Oh, no. I thought he was trying to come through my door. <laughs> oh man. I, I couldn't resist, guys. I know that was a dick move, but I couldn't fucking resist. Well, because he was going to be a pussy and try and take my kill through the wall, to be completely honest. You know, I mean, he can see through the wall that there's already a dude in here. So I've got, you know, I've got the place covered, man. I mean, you go do your own thing. Just so you guys know, my videos, especially right now, since I'm kind of learning everything and getting comfortable making these, and uh, you know, it's hard to think about things to talk about that, you know, people would be interested in while trying to focus on a game. So, they're going to be more really casual as far as, like, they're going to be more live stream style, really, even though they might not have been streamed live. Um, oh, shit. One friendly operator remaining. Oh man, what the hell? Where is he? Oh wait, it's me, duh. Mission critical, bomb diffuser activated. What? Where? Disable it. Oh man. Mission failed. All friendly. I know I suck, guys, but. I wasn't gonna win that anyway. There's too fucking many of them. And I, all my, all my teammates were dead. Well, that sucks. I was like, "What the hell's going on, dude? Why are they all dying?"
drone has located a bomb. Those guys are doing. Uh -oh. Don't seconds. kill me, no! <laughs> Damn it. Five seconds to insertion. The diffuser has been secured. You've located a bomb. I think the, 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 the uh, smoke control is going to spark. What the, what the fuck, dude? The diffuser. the diffuser is now secured. You fucking idiot! Uh, I'm sorry, guys. I'm... I'm totally fucking sorry. Dropping mag! Now we're gonna have to sit through a whole match. Starting shock. You have dropped the diffuser. The diffuser has been recovered. Yay! Some fucking douchebag. He's probably the guy. I didn't look at the guy's name until I killed him. I imagine that's probably him. Yeah, people get butt hurt because you have a reason to kill them, and so you kill them, but then they kill you for absolutely no reason. It's kind of a retaliation thing, which is retarded. I mean, if I did something like if I was if I did what that dude did, and some dude shot me in the face because of it, I would therefore not kill him the next round. I'd be like, oh, okay, yeah, you're right, I fucked up. I shouldn't have been trying to steal your kills like an asshole. Let's see if we can do the uh, bot mode. Usually there's always, when I when I played this before, uh, uh, when I was playing this before, people were always playing this mode. So... I don't know what's going on here. Hey, are any of my viewers, if uh, any of my viewers are, um, uh, are looking forward to Roller Coaster Ty Tycoon World or Planet Coaster, uh, go ahead and uh, leave me comments down in, in, down below. And uh, let me know what you guys think of either game and which one you're looking forward to most. I'm, I'm a huge, you know, I started playing Roller Coaster Tycoon when I was a kid. And uh, I'm a big, so I'm a huge fan of it. Um, and I've always liked uh, roller coaster, them, like theme park games, since then. But I find that, I don't know, I, it's, it's a hard decision because Planet Coaster is. Planet Coaster is like what I would have wanted of Roller Coaster Tycoon World, to be completely honest. I mean, I understand that world, it's a, you know, in video games, they're a small, they're making Planet Coast and Tycoon World, they're a small, small, small team. They're, they're a super small team, and they have a really low budget, and um, there's already been two developers who worked on the game prior, um, and in video games had to start over from scratch, because what the other two teams made were complete, was complete. If you guys think, I mean, that's the thing, if you guys think World of Coast Tycoon World looks bad now, you guys should see what what Invisio Games did with it when they first had it, and people complained, and they changed it to what it is now. There is a big difference. And then you should see what it looks like. Uh, I don't know what's going on, guys. I guess that uh, mode is... I'll try one more time, but... And then you should see what the game looked like from the other developers before Invisio Games got their hands on it. Uh, it was even worse. It, it, it looked like... A predecessor to Roller Coaster Tycoon 2. I mean, it, it it was like between three and two. It was it was fucking nuts. Um, yeah, yeah. Uh, I I I don't know. I th I guess I'm just gonna get Planet Coaster. Anyway, if you guys are like, what the hell is he talking about? You should go uh, go to um. Uh, just go to Google and search for Planet, uh, Roller Coaster Tycoon World, 
and uh, Planet Coaster. Planet Coaster is being developed by Frontier. Frontier were the uh, they were the ones who made uh, Roller Coaster Tycoon 3. Um, and then, uh, as I said before earlier, Roller Coaster Tycoon World is being made by Envisio Games. They're a little small game company. Um, they they do pretty decent. I mean, they haven't done anything good, you know. And they, I don't think they've made a PC game. I think everything they've done is mobile. So I think Tycoon is it's not only their first PC game, but it's also the biggest project that they've ever had to do. And it and it has some of the biggest feats they've ever had to like figure out how to do. Uh, it's been a big challenge for them. So. Um, I think what they've done with it so far, and I think how far they've come, I think they've done a great job. People right now are bashing the shit out of them. I mean, it, it's, it really makes, it, it's sad to see. I mean, it makes me sad to see because, you know, I mean, you got these guys who've never made anything like this before, you know, and they're doing their best, and they've made a lot of progress, and I think what they've accomplished has been really, really good. So, to see the whole community just... I mean, just relentlessly bash them, even though, if, and here's the sad part is that when the first beta came out like four or five months ago, I think it was December or something like that, when the first beta came out, everyone's like, we want this and this and this, we don't like this, 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 we want this, 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 this. Well, they came out and they fucking said, okay, two, three months later, they showed us a live stream of all those features that everybody wanted incorporated and working. Like they did just about all the main stuff that people wanted and then what did people do they fucking bashed them anyway so I'm sorry guys I'm not really playing here I'm trying but see that's one of the reasons why I don't get into this game because it feels I don't know it has this weird feeling about it it's like you're always watching you know at least I am or some fucking teammate kills me and then I have to you know spend three minutes sitting here watching other people play and it always feels like you're not really you're not involved a lot of the time I don't know it's just at least that's for me because I, I suck so tickle party 22 uh, okay I mean, this video is going to, I mean, I'm not going to be on here for two hours, you know, I, I want at least there's going to be some, some freaking gameplay in here. I'm sorry guys, I'm still new at this, and plus I can't control the, the game. Maybe this isn't that great of a game to uh, make videos on, honestly. I thought it would be because it's the FPS and people, a lot of people like action, you know, they want to watch game they want to watch uh, like action oriented games but I don't I have a lot of those but I don't have any new shooters I mean I didn't get the new Call of Duty I didn't really like the last one so I, I don't think I'm gonna get the new Call of Duty I'm uh, there's really not a lot of shooters out there at the moment um, I mean I'm definitely getting the division so that'll be that'll that will probably be fun to stream uh, live stream and record But as of right now, yeah, I'm just pretty much playing this for shooter. Well, this and uh, Battlefield, uh, uh, Battlefront, Battle, um, Star Wars Battlefront. Sorry. Which actually, I should probably make make a video of next. I did make a video of that, but I only put it on Facebook. It was like right before. Uh, it's, it, it was one of the videos that made me decide to start doing YouTube for real. Like, seriously, this time. I'm trying to upload, you know, at least one video a week, but I seem to have, um, I seem to be, you know, Secure the I'd box. like to do two or three, honestly, but I don't know, we'll see. Right now, I'm not editing these. I don't really have any color corrections to do, and, or anything like that. It's not, you know, that kind of video, so it's not. It doesn't take me that long to get them. To it's not that hard to make them. 
Wait, why are you guys? Ten seconds. Device sent. Deploying welcome mat. Device five seconds. You must protect your bombs from being defused by Op Four. This is probably not a good spot, Mark. Heading to Rock and Well, the enemy's out there somewhere. Oh shit. I didn't realize there was a door right there above. Window, window barricaded. Dude, close these windows. Four has located a bomb. A bomb has been located by Op Four. One friendly oh, remaining. What the fuck? There's no way, dude. He... I gotta see this. Damn. Mission failed. Yeah, All they friendlies sure took, have been neutralized. Really fucking, they sure took a long time to start trying to get in.
Understood. Need to use your drone to locate a bomb. I think this part's pretty cool. That if your team can find the bomb before the match starts, you know, because it, it gives you an advantage. And this is probably how it would go down in time. 10 seconds to insertion. Insertion in 5 seconds. Be advised your drone has located okay, a bomb. Someone found it. The diffuser has been secured. Okay. You've located a bomb. Make your way to its location and defuse it. Bomb has been located. Operator standing. God damn it. All friendlies have been eliminated. Yeah, I think I want to find a better team. Or actually, how long has this how long has this video been going? Yeah, it's been going long enough. Alright guys, well I apologize about the game having issues and me dying a lot and not having a whole ton of gameplay, but um, yeah, for what it is, I hope you guys enjoyed it and uh, I'll catch you in the next one.